Hey, what's up, guys? I have another uh, app review for you today. It's called iEraced. That right there in the corner. It's a utility app, and it's available for $6.99 in the App Store, and has only one purpose in mind: making sure that your files, that your deleted files, stay deleted. Have you ever deleted a embarrassing or private photo, or deleted a confidential email, and ever? wondered if it was really permanently deleted without some hacker being able to retrieve it or something like that? Well, an I erase might just be your next app to purchase. What does it do? I erase creates a large temporary file which writes zeros, for example, over the free space where your deleted pictures or emails can still be. I erase will temporarily fill your disk with the zero data so like this is basically taking up the space on your iPhone so that all the pictures and emails possibly they just can't stay there because there's no room. So because the pictures and files have no place to stay in your iPhone, they delete permanently. This is the same method that Mac OS X uses to free your uh, the space as well, same method. Um, I would like to show a video or example, but the process of it takes longer than the 10 minutes that YouTube would allow. Um, me. Ten minutes into the process for me and it was only about 45 percent complete. It had already done about one gigabyte. Um, this explains the pictures you are seeing. Really there isn't much to show. All you get is this confirmation. This confirmation here that tells you if you would like to proceed with the process but tells you to keep your iPhone connected to a power source and having your auto lock set to never. Like so. In the new uh, current version 1.1, it allows you to run under lock. So um, if you forget and you do run it, it will be okay as it will still be running. Uh, when you get a phone call, it says it will continue when the when you're done with the phone call. Um, but my second time doing it, the operation it just simply said aborted. Um, it was like a two-minute phone call, so I don't know about that feature. I'll have to try it again and maybe update it with the annotation. The time it takes to complete also varies on the free space available on your phone, and it says it's good to run this periodically. So if you were to purchase this app, running this application about once a month or once every two months, I think would be pretty good. This is also a nice app to run right before selling or giving away your iPhone. It's highly recommended. But uh, for $7, it is kind of pricey. But um, if you need your privacy, you need to make sure that those pictures are never ever seen again or your emails are never checked or something like that, I think um, it might be worth it. So like I said, $7 in the App Store, I erase. Um, it's iPhone 3.0 compatible. Um, has a pretty good star rating, 3.5. Um, I would probably recommend it around four. It does what it says and everything, um, so I guess that's good. The process takes forever, but like I said, that depends all on your free space available on your iPhone. And uh, so obviously right here it says, this utility will zero the free space on your iPhone's user portion. No live data will be deleted. Keep your iPhone connected to a power source and set your auto lock preference never to avoid sleeping. Press the home button at any time to, to abort the operation. So this is um, a very good app, like I said. And once you hit continue, it will just start erasing, uh, or yeah, the free space, and writing it over with all that data. And once it is done, it will simply um, the iPhone will inform you that you are running out of free space. You just allow it to finish, and once it's complete, all the space will be freed up again. So I hope you enjoyed this review slash demo. Um, for more, subscribe to my YouTube account, follow me on Twitter, check out my blog, irockish.blogspot.com. All the links are in the sidebar to your right, and thank you for watching.